all their toenails this morning so they'd be pretty. <laughs> Every week we got to cut toenails, do mm -hmm. <laughs> Right now is when it's more work for us. Yeah. The first three weeks, like we say, the whelping box and, and Mama pretty well takes care of them. We make sure Mom eats and drinks and and uh, she cleans up after them, except we have another doggie, Tulip, that goes back next week. She's our future leader dog of the year. Oh. And she's she's been helping Tessa clean them. And um, But this week we started work with them. We took out the whelping box, turned it into what my granddaughter says, the apartment. <laughs> and um, our job then is to give them different experiences. We have a whole, this is all full of toys and different things for them to play with. Um, and every day we bring out a couple things mm -hmm. and let them play with it and get used to it. And um, like Frank says, we'll be taking them out this afternoon. We haven't got it all puppy proofed yet on the deck and they go fall through now, going through the railings. But, but um, and, and we have to feed them. We started out feeding them once a day. Now it's twice a day. Tomorrow will be three times a day. And we're moistening their food. And then little by little, <laughs> we'll stop moistening, and it'll be hard food. By the last, by the time they're here for their last week, they'll be eating three meals a day, about a half a cup each time, mm -hmm. and it'll be hard food, hard kibble. What? Now we're gonna do the elephant walk. Okay? No. And these are their toy boxes. We put all the toys in here at night time, and in the morning when we get up, they're all over. And, and, they'll, they'll, and they get in there. And three of them will get underneath them and sleep, sleep, you know.